Welcome to Vegan Paradise. This is the Amy's Asian Dumpling Bowl. You're talking about spectacular. You're talking about full flavor. You're talking about something good to eat. You have to try this. For real, for real. First thing you want to do is go ahead and take it out of the package. And you want to go ahead and just inspect it. Make sure everything is in it is good. Make sure you don't have no hair or anything like that. You just never know what you can run into. Then you want to go ahead and... Uh, of course, you know, it is vegan. It only has wheat and soy products in it. Um, but you want to go ahead and crack this bad boy open. You want to go ahead and put it inside of the microwave. Initially, you want to cook it for three minutes. No water, no additives or anything of that nature. Once you put it in there for three minutes, warm it up, take it out, look at it. See how much liquid is in it. See how many juices are in it from the vegetables being frozen. If it's kind of dry, if it needs a little bit more water, a little bit more liquid, you can put a little bit more liquid in it. Of course, if you want to use vegetable broth or chicken broth or whatever the case may be, you can use that too, but I just use water. The flavor itself is off the chain in this bowl. So you only want to use just a little bit, just a little bit of water. Enough to make sure that everything stays moist as you finish cooking the remainder of it. Um, as you can see, as I take the fork and unfold it, you can see that it's still some cold spots and there's still a lot of sauce that needs to be mixed in with the noodles and everything. So, like I said, we're going to add just a little bit of water to it just to make sure that everything is legit perfect. Yes, I said perfect. You can. So as we go ahead and add a little bit more water, let's throw it back into the microwave and get it positioned and get it exactly where we need to be so we can get this thing ate or eaten or whatever you want to say it is. So as you can see, it's a lot more creamy here now. As you can see, it's exactly where it needs to be. And I guarantee if you follow the steps in which I did, you will get the same consistency. But we gotta put it back for another minute and 30 seconds in order for it to have that creamy texture that I was looking for. Creamy texture. We want it to be creamy. We want it to taste just right. And that's exactly what we're doing. You can add butter, you can add salt, you can add pepper, whatever you want to add to it, you can. But I left it the same because it is delicious. You should go to your Kroger's or Walmart or wherever you can find it. I got mine from Whole Foods. Enjoy the Amy Dumpling Bowls. This isn't the only one that I'm going to be doing a review on. Majority of them are amazing. But this one is my absolute favorite. So there you have it. Thank you for watching Vegan, True Vegan Paradise, and this is a review of the Amy Dumpling Bowl.